Hello and welcome back to Promotional Store Shelf Stand Mockup Help video. In this video, I'll show you how to edit the mockup template and add your own designs. So, let's open up the template. Once you open up the template, in the layers panel, you'll see uh, three different um, groups. Uh, you have a group uh, for the mockups. Uh, you have the settings and the stands. Now, uh, in the stands here, you can change the different types of the stand, like wood, plastic, uh, aluminum. Um, let's choose wood for this instance, or maybe plastic. And um, the way to edit this mockup is to go to uh, place your design here uh, group and choose uh, the smart object that you wish to edit. Uh, let's start with the display. Double click on it, it will open up in the new window. So all you have to do now is go to File, Place, and I'm gonna choose the file that I already have. Now, uh, if your file that you're importing is the newer version and it has layers, it's going to give you the option to keep the layers or flatten the image. I've kept the layers, but you can flatten the image uh, if you don't plan on working on this any longer. And now all I have to do is I can I can leave it like this, but uh, to save a little bit in the size, I'm just going to go to the right click and then go here to merge down. And once I have uh, everything merged, I'm going to go to File, Save. It's going to save the smart object file. And once I go back, it's going to be updated here in the main preview. So you do that for all of your elements. I just want to point out the side panel because it has this curve. Make sure to have the side panel left activated before you start importing it. So I'm gonna place side, I'm just gonna flatten it. Now of course you can scale it up and down, you can change the size, apply, and uh, you can either import your own designs or you can create the designs uh, while you're working. So. Let me just add this heart shape here, for instance. And now I'm going to save everything. Now I can also merge these layers in order to save some space. But if it's work in progress uh, and you want to go uh, back and forth and see how the design applies on your um, shelf, you can save them in layers. And once the layers are been saved, it's going to be updated in the main preview. It's going to take a little bit of time because this is a big file. Okay, and now when we go back, this has been updated too. Of course, you continue doing this to all of the um, smart objects and you get your own design. All that it's left to do is either export this, uh, change your background, uh, move this to uh, some other uh, composition and that's it. That was it for this tutorial. Thank you for watching this help video and remember if you have any questions about the mock-up or you need any additional help please feel free to contact me and I'll try to respond as soon as possible. Have a fantastic day and see you soon. Bye!